I'll start off with trade secrets because since Dan works mostly with physicians, doctors, uh, professionals, uh, trade secrets is probably one of the, uh, the key pieces of intellectual property that you should be concerned with that a lot of people overlook. And trade secrets are essentially that. They're your secret. Your formula, your process, your pattern of doing something that is key to your business, that is a secret. And most importantly, this includes your client list. There's no formal way of registering a trade secret. Essentially, what you need to do is protect it by contracts to keep it a secret. It's information that's not generally known to the public. It confers some sort of economic benefit to its holder, and you need to maintain the secrecy of it. And it's important to note that once the bell is rung, it's rung. So if, if you lose that secrecy, no matter how it happens, you lost the, the protection of the trade secret. So you must maintain the secret that's generally done through contracts and other measures to ensure that no one has access to that trade secret. 